what is shift work? So I want to talk about the different shifts because a lot of times we think about shift work and we think about the nighttime shift and there's so much more than the nighttime shift. So first we have our day shift. This is our traditional nine to five hours. You know, you get to go to work during the day, sleep during the night. Then we have our night shift, which is what a lot of people think when they think about shift work. They think about the person that's working from midnight to early morning and that works overnight and has to sleep during the day. But we actually have a shift in between there. And that's called our swing shift, our second shift, our evening shift. And it really starts in the evening after day shift goes home. And it's the shift between day shift and night shift. So a lot of times it might be from like 5 p.m. to 11 or whatever the actual time is. But it's that nighttime shift that covers between daytime and the night shift. Then we have something what we call split shift. And this is a lot of times seen in our first responders and things like that. And this is the shift that actually gets split up. So you might do four hours in the morning and four hours in the evening, and then you have time off in between. And then we have rotating shifts. So rotating shifts basically rotate through day, night, and evening shift on generally some sort of pattern. So you might work two days day shift, two days evening shift, then you're off two days and then you work two day night shifts or one week day shifts, one week night shifts and one week the swing shift, whatever the rotating pattern is, but they're rotating through that. And then we have something that a lot of us are familiar with, but we don't often think about it as a ship work is on call. You know, a lot of us in the corporate environments, we're familiar with an on-call shift. You know, maybe we're having to cover weekends or cover evenings to make sure China's covered when they come back to work on Monday and things like that. So these on-call shifts can happen maybe once a month, maybe every few weeks. And basically, it's in a you're on call. So if someone calls, you're on. It could be at 2 o'clock in the afternoon. It could be 2 o'clock at night. And this is where a lot of times, especially if you're a corporate worker, maybe you work a traditional nine to five job, but one weekend a month, you're on an on call. So that can throw off your sleep cycle. It could throw off your nutrition. It might throw off just time with the family. So a lot of times it requires you to be flexible in some area. And this is where we see some challenges just when we work these shifts and one of the things that was the hardest for me to understand was seeing that a lot of the health and wellness information out there is designed for a nine to five lifestyle. 